was best man at my sister's wedding. And that's the first I met him. And then I said, I know he's for me. <laughs> and I said, what did you think, honey? And he said, I thought the same thing. <laughs> so it was, we had a wonderful marriage. We were on the farm 67 years and we raised chickens and had eggs. The kids learned to milk and we turned our own butter. He was 92 when he passed. Had a good life. He had a stroke and uh, he was paralyzed on his right side and he was right-handed. So he had a lot of adjustments to make. So that's why our move came here. And I'm very, very happy we did. Security, no worries. We sold our acreage. I just love the attached garage. I can still drive. I enjoy playing cards. I like to contribute to the things that are helping others. I'm glad that they have the food pantry basket down here because I like that. And I've always been active in the church and I always cut up the bread for cubes for communion. And, and it just makes you feel so good. It's a nice, nice place. The people, you know, everybody is so good. They are very attentive, they're very helpful. I mean, they're not just here. I know they have to make a living, but it doesn't seem like they are. That's number one in their life. Our staff here is just excellent. They do a phenomenal job. We encourage the staff to interact with the tenants, you know, in a positive way and give them a hug and touch their hand and um, help them with their hair and, and, and just engage with them um, at mealtime um, and any time they can. If they have time to sit down and talk with them, that's what they do. They go into the rooms and they find out how their day's been going. I just, I just think it's a wonderful place. Thank you.